The People's Democratic Party in Edo has raised concerns about a plot by the All Progressive Congress APC to manipulate the electoral process ahead of the September 21st gubernatorial election. PDP State Chairman Tony Azegbemi revealed that the APC has devised a scheme to deploy counterfeit independent National Electoral Commission personnel during the upcoming polls. Nearly all the political parties had issues with the polling agents that they uploaded. APC did not meet the requirements in 3,037 polling units. In fact, I will show you a sample of the kind of polling agents that APC uploaded on INET portal. Emojis were uploaded by APC onto INET portal as agents. Um, Labor Party had the same person in a hundred places uploaded. But the most surprising thing for us as a party was that APC had the effrontery to upload foreigners as their agents. In all, APC did not do the right thing in 3,037 poly units. Azek Bame called on INEC to ensure transparency by publishing the names and photographs of all appointed resident electoral commissioners. PDP did the right thing in 4,378 police units. We, as a party, we did not get it right in 141 police units. This brings us to a major question, which is, how can a political party, such as the APC and the Labour Party, that cannot upload the list of agents on the dedicated portal by INEC. How can you trust such a party with your votes? How can you trust such a party with power? How can we allow such a party to, to get close to government house? We've consistently said that the APC is a party that is made up of fraudsters and criminals. We are demanding, in view of the foregoing, that INEC should not allow any political party or all the political parties that did not meet the requirements in the, in the polling units not to substitute or be allowed to effect changes to those uh, uh, agents. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.